Hi guys, this is Rahul and you're welcome to gomahamaya.com. In this beautiful tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to fix a page indexing blocked by robot.txt. Here you can see, uh, I put my website for the validation. If I'll click on see details, you can see there's like 128 spending and zero failed. So I put for the validation and they are still validating. There's validation is too slow. That's why they are now approving all my requests, which I fix it. And I want to share with you people that how you can fix it. You can see like uh, in November it was like 400 and slowly slowly start decreasing and finally I reached to 128 and it will take around one to two months to finish all these things. So first step for fixing is to know what is robot.txt and why Google feels like you block these URLs. I'll explain you that thing then I'll teach you how to fix it so I'm going to take you to my website let's say if I'll go to gomahamaya.com and if I'll write robots.txt then you'll see I'm telling user agents that you are disallowed inside WP admin disallow inside WP comment post.php disallow trackback, disallow xml rpc, disallow forward slash go folder and disallow forward slash out folder, disallow forward slash black hole. And these are the things I disallowed them and these are the things which I allowed them. So they can enter inside these resources and collect the URLs and the data, but they cannot go inside these URLs. This is just to tell the user agent robot.txt for the bots who crawl the website. So they, they should not disobey these rules. Now I'll go back to our uh, search engine console and there you can see like here you can see the gomahamaya.com forward slash go forward slash host is blocked and is blocked by robot.txt because I said it to block. Here you can see forward slash go is blocked and here you can see this allowed black hole is blocked. So here you can see the black hole is blocked. You will find a robot.txt file inside your public underscore HTML of your domain where you'll find WP admin, WP content, WP includes and there in the same file you'll find robot.txt. If you could not find just download this file, click control save and go desktop control.txt file is there. Click save and upload similar one just remove these two because these these three are my custom one and you can change the sitemap url and that will be your robot.txt file so now after you upload click on edit and there you can see these are my urls that is not working so now i'm going to take you to google search console where you can check whether the URL is blocked or not. So I'm going to select the property that is gomahamaya.com. Now they're going to fetch your uh, robot.txt file. Now I want to write dev. Okay. And I'll click on test. Here you can see allowed. It's allowed to crawl that. Similarly, you can choose any of these URLs from your search engine console and test whether it's blocked by your robot.txt file is not or we have another option so i'll click on test okay it's allowed because like i have two slashes i have to remove one slash and now i'll click on test now you can see it's blocked by go folder similarly you can know the exact reason why that file is blocked by the google robot.txt or there is another reason behind it if it is blocked by robot.txt then you can fix by removing this this particular line from your robot.txt file not from the google search console this tester you have to remove from a server that file i shown you robot.txt inside a public underscore html file then you if you click on test file you will see you are allowed all the urls such as forward slash go forward slash kingstar forward slash a black hole these urls are not relevant for me if i'll go on the next page also you'll see these urls are not relevant for me so for me it's good that this is blocked by robot.txt file if i'll remove that 
it means I'm, I'm going to affect my website indirectly. So don't worry about that robot.txt block is not bad. It's good for bad URLs like which you do not want to expose to the outer world for slash. For example, if you're using affiliate link and it should be blocked, if your any of your important URL is blocked, then you have to think how to fix it. I hope I'm clear till this part. Now I'm going to explain you how to remove these URLs when you're getting the errors. First part, go and check your robot.txt file. If any of your URL is blocked by, let's say if I, if I write down disallow in WP content, then your image file will be blocked. Your upload content folder will be blocked. So in that case, you might get an error. So remove that line which is creating problem for you and make sure that URL is important for you then only remove that line. Let's say if my out folder URL is important, I'll remove this disallow out folder or you can write here allowed out folder. You can also create filter based on the robots type such as Google bots, Yahoo bots, Bing bots. You can create different kinds of robot.txt file based on that too. Next step for you is to log into your dashboard and once you are logged in, you need to hover over setting and click on the reading part and you'll see discourage search engine from indexing. You have to uncheck this option. If it's ticked, you have to uncheck it and click save change. Now Google bots or any other important bots are able to index your website or edit your robot.txt file from your website and third method we have is that I know this is blocked by my robot.txt file but Google want me to fix it. How should I fix it? Now you have to copy it and the main reason behind you are getting the error is these URLs are not important to Google users, not important for you too. So the Google want you to remove these URLs from indexing and your site will be free from any kinds of confusions and go to removal. If it's not important, go to removal one, request new one and click your URL, click next and say submit. Now request will be submitted and Google will remove that URL. Similarly here you can see I submitted request for block hole removal, block hole removal, block hole removal. Here you can see I, I requested for removing forward slash go folder itself and I requested removing Kingsta, I requested removing Bluehost, I requested removing Thetis and I even requested removing easy digital download. This is the last method you have to follow for non-relevant link which is not useful for your website. To get index inside the Google, you just remove it, that's all. So this is the only solution which is there to fix the issue. So I hope you find this video useful. If you did, give thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more further updates. Thank you.